Hey guys, Xkudo is back and we are back on the vlogs. So we're heading to the gym now, we're doing back and biceps. Um, I'm going with my friend Robert, Jeslin, and I got a new car so I'm going to show you guys that. Um, it's going to be a little hard because I do not have any light, well there's no light outside. I mean it's, um, we're in Canada, 6 o'clock so it's really dark. I might show you guys tomorrow because I'm going to record tomorrow as well. But anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead over there and pick them up quickly. Just got here at Jeslin's house. He's going to pack up his stuff quickly and then we're going to go pick up Robert. Here, here we got, we got Jeslin. <laughs> we got another six foot, six foot five. Six six. Six six. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Six six. Got your shoes. Six, six. Ready. Ready to make some gains. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna start off this workout with a little commentary. So I went to the gym today with my friend Robert and Jeslin. Robert got a lot of recordings, so it's perfect. Um, but anyways, we did back and biceps. Um, a lot of my exercises that you'll see, I don't go at heavy, but I still do heavy sets. Um, it's more so because the injury of my shoulder. What happened pretty much is I hit someone funny, if you guys didn't watch the last video. Um, so it was injured for about two weeks. It's still a little injured, so that's why I'm still uh, getting back into the gym. Um, Still really shredded because I'm eating healthy to an extent. <laughs> I still have chocolate here and there. I mean, I think everybody does. But yeah, I'm going back into the gym here, guys. Um, the exercise we did before in the beginning, the pulls, I did one uh, warm-up set, two heavy working sets, and two lighter working sets. So the lighter ones are more 12 to 15 and then a burnout. And the same thing with the lap pull-downs. We did a warm-up set. We always do a warm-up set for every exercise. But then we also did two working sets and another two working sets and then a burnout. But for this exercise uh, that I'm showing you guys right now, we did three sets of 12 to 15. It was more for the squeeze. The main thing you should focus on when you're doing this exercise is putting your chest on the pad itself and pushing your hips back. You guys could kind of see from this angle a little bit better. And bring your elbows up to hit that upper back and those upper traps to get that pretty much... Um, upper back really I mean it's gonna hit your upper back uh, instead of hit that tree of your back and for this exercise now uh, you can see I'm a little hunched over yes my shoulders still bothering me so it was a little bit harder to do this one but um, what you should focus on on this exercise is keep your chest out shoulders back and squeeze those lats now we went on to biceps so with biceps we just did regular curls we actually had um, two sets of barbells uh, one was 55, one was 35. Uh, we would do a drop set right after the 55. We did three sets with each a drop set. So we did 12 to 15 on the 55 and 12 to 15 on the 35. So that's about roughly 30 reps per set for three sets. So it's about 90 reps. Um, and then we moved it on to cables. Uh, for the cable for me, it was a little tough because my shoulders bothered me a lot. But I did about two sets of 10 to 12, I believe. And then we went on to dumbbells. We did about three sets of 20. So it's about 10 reps on each arm because it's alternating. Um, we didn't do too, too much on biceps or any of that, guys, because, well, for me personally, because of my shoulder. But um, the other guys uh, went a little bit heavier. Um, but you can see I'm only doing about 20 pounds here. I'm just trying to get a pump, you know, to get that feel still, get back into the gym. I haven't actually... I've uh, been working out much recently. It's been about two weeks since my injury and it's still a little injured. It should be fine soon. But um, anyways, this was me, my ab uh, exercise. The first one we did was um, just crunches for the upper abs, 12 to 15, three sets. Then I did obliques and that was pretty much the workout for today, guys. Just got out of the steam room, hot tub, cold pool. Didn't record everything, didn't record all of the app session. But anyways, we're gonna be dropping off for this guy, this guy, and then we're gonna get something to eat. We had- We're gonna edit that. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> anyways, yeah, I'm gonna drop him off quickly. Just got home, today was a busy day. Had hockey in the morning, went to the gym. Um, I didn't record everything, I already told you guys that, but I recorded as much as I could. Recorded the highlights, in a way. Um, Anyways, I dropped off my two friends. The big guy was Robert. The second guy, a little bit shorter, <laughs> Jeslin. Um, they live close to me, so it's really easy to um, get by and all that. And the fact that I drive, it makes it that much easier. Anyways, we went to the gym. Uh, we won our game today against Grand Prairie 4-1. And we won yesterday. I believe it was... Yeah, it was 2-1. We scored when there was about 10 seconds left. So, I mean, awesome, right? Two wins. Gotta go to the gym, 
injured my shoulder you guys already know that so I couldn't go too too hard but um, it's been about two weeks now so my shoulders feeling a lot better than before so I added a little bit more weight um, I don't know if you guys saw very well but I added a little bit more weight into my workout and so probably I'd say about three four days 100% the shoulder is gonna be 100% but right now I'm gonna go get something to eat quickly and see what I really have down there probably ground beef ground beef and honey garlic the best sauce in the world and after that I'm gonna be watching um, the trilogy of Matrix I already watched the first movie and it kind of reminds me of Inception like I mean there's two worlds it's it's just sick like the trilogy is awesome um, anyways I'm gonna go do that quickly see you guys in a bit We've got ourselves here the ground beef, lean ground beef with honey garlic sauce and some rice. You could barely see the rice under, but yes, there is a little bit of rice under there. But that is my meal, post-workout uh, meal. Now, I'm going to eat it quickly. I still got to get some water um, and watch The Matrix. I don't think I'll be able to finish the whole trilogy. I'll probably be able to watch the second movie. And then the third movie tomorrow in the morning, and then we're gonna hit I believe legs tomorrow So stay tuned for that guys. It's gonna be a good leg workout I'm gonna eat this massive amount of protein Massive amount of protein is probably good like Over 100 grams of protein definitely I ended up finishing the trilogy, the Matrix trilogy, at like 2.30 a.m. So it was quite late, but it was worth it. Now I'm watching the last Shrek, I believe, yeah. Shrek Forever After. But I know this is a lot of carbs that I got. All that Nutella, all that bread. Super yummy. But I'm just going to have it, like, because I'm too lazy to make a normal breakfast. And... But later on, I'll probably have some eggs before I go to the gym. And today I am doing legs, so I need all the carbs I could get, all the energy I could get before um, before the workout itself. But I know, yeah, it's yeah, a lot of carbs. focus look at that lighting <laughs> okay so well maybe it's too bright let me just adjust that brightness oh, I think it's making it brighter no okay perfect all right and so we're gonna go pick up Jaslyn right now we're gonna be hitting legs Robert couldn't come today because he's working he works at a um, grocery store so he pretty much just gives people his groceries you know vegetables fruits but yeah, okay, I'm gonna show you guys my car quickly because there's light up. So that's my car Pontiac Aztec 2001. It's a big upgrade compared to my last car. Okay, let's go open it up, show you guys what it's like. Pontiac Aztec. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I know guys oh biggest upgrade yet so here we got the dash hard to see not that much lighting in there you got the radio you got the heating my car does not did not have heating on my Jeep Cherokee 1989 I got my little thing for my phone review mirror oh yeah perfect and then I got a couple other things here. It's automatic. Uh, I don't use standard. I don't know how to use standard. I mean, 
damn though guys I mean it's here let me just put the key in perfect let's see if I could put that light on oh, it doesn't show but yeah see so there's just a little air there that's for the sensor so one of the sensors are cut I believe it's the ABS sensor um, it's not really the ABS specific sensor but um it's more so uh, the sensor that keeps the wheels spinning um, depending on if you're pushing on gas or not. So let's say if I'm going at like 50 kilometers an hour and I stop pushing the gas, you know how like a normal car would slowly slow down or just slow down naturally? This car kind of just lets the wheels keep spinning because it can't really detect how fast you're going and stuff like that. So you just kind of have to drive accordingly to the situation. So. You know, if you notice you're coming in a little too fast, you're gonna have to use the brakes a little more. So that's pretty much what it is. You're just gonna have to use the brakes a little more. But anyways, this is a sick car. I mean, I'm just so happy I got it. Um, I got it from an auction for about 1,050 bucks. I mean, no problems with it really. I mean, there's one little sensor that's cut. I could fix that, it doesn't cost me that much. Uh, left outer tie rod and that's about it. Everything else is pretty much, I could. it could last me a year or two. And by then I could get a new car for cheap and and then constantly be building up um, some more money so this is what I got for now guys but uh, I mean overall it's looking pretty good there's the back it's kind of see here um, there's uh, all brand new winter tires um, change the transmission already that cost me about 200 transmission fluid and transmission filter so and then the oil the oil is fine right now it's um it's a little dirty but it's nothing like that i need to change right now i will change later on but right now this car is working well you know no problem so that's what i got guys 2001 pontiac aztec So we finished up there with legs, shoulders, and a little bit of abs. Um, I didn't really show too much of the workout because, I mean, there's lots of people right now. People are ending work. So anyways, uh, I'm just going to drop off Jeslin, and then I'm going to get something to eat. Then I'm going to see if I can sell my car today. So this is the old Jeep, as you guys saw in past vlogs, that I'm planning on selling for about 500. Um, you know, I'm if I don't get 500, you know, so be it. But here, let me show you quickly. Got my old Jeep Cherokee. Lots of memories. The power still turns on, but the engine doesn't. So we're thinking it's the fuel pump. We still have to see. Here, I'll show you guys the front quickly. Yeah. All right, let's put this key in, show you guys what's up. So, the power does turn on, this key in, but the engine does not. So you guys can see, all right, all the power turns on, shows the time, radio turns on, you know, everything, right? 
the only problem is um, the engine doesn't turn on. So see, this is the sound it makes. It just it doesn't go. You know what I mean? So it's some something to do with the engine itself, but I can't get my hands on it. it has a lot of kilometers on it, but you know I'm gonna sell this car for about 500 more or less. Hopefully I could get close to it. If I don't, you know I'm just trying to get rid of it, right? Um, and what I will go to is pretty much uh, helping my other car or uh, working on my other car, you know, like with because um, uh, I have to fix the outer tie rod and one sensor. So, I mean, this is going to help it out overall. So, yeah, all the power works. The um, lights work, the turning signals. I got a new ignition switch in it a long time ago. It cost me 300 So, I mean, uh, hopefully I can get a decent price for it, but um, the guy's gonna, supposed to be coming soon to check it out. Yum, yum, yum. I got myself some beef here. I cooked it with honey garlic. I got, instead of ground beef, change it up, just like regular beef. Beef, rice, all that great stuff. So anyways, that's pretty much the vlog for today. Um, a little bit of a shorter, I don't know if it was shorter than yesterday's, but it's all together. Today, yesterday, today is January, what's even the date today? I'm gonna check quickly. You guys already see what the date is in this here. My computer's saying forever. February 1st. I don't know how I don't know that. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, you guys can kinda see February 1st. I don't think it's gonna focus. Let's see. Focus. Yeah, it's not gonna focus. Anyways, today is February 1st. I'm going to be heading to hockey really soon here, so that's going to be the end of the vlog. But it was a little bit of a different vlog. I know I edited it differently. Um, I still haven't edited it just yet, but I know I'm going to edit it differently because that's what I'm going to do. Um, it's more so going to be a little bit like um, this guy named Casey. I don't know if you guys know who he is, but he is a vlogger on YouTube. Um, very popular, gets millions of views. But he ed edits pretty cool. He puts lots of uh, ro reality free music, so it's kind of like um, more hip, more uh, modern, and um, a little more like a lifestyle kind of uh, video. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. Um, just let me know how you guys, um, what you guys thought of it, because this is the end of the video. So what you guys thought of it, and really um, if I should incorporate it more. Um, you know, I like to do different things with my uh, videos. I really like doing editing um, thing, like editing video. I really like editing videos. I'm really good with the software. So um, if there's any requests or if you guys like what I'm doing, be sure to leave it in the comments. But anyways, guys, that is the end of the vlog. I'm just gonna eat my food right now, and I'll see you guys in the next one. But please leave a like below, comment, subscribe, and get aesthetic.